Hello guys, thank you guys so much for tuning in to another video. It's Tabitha here. All my new subscribers as well, thank you guys so much for tuning in. You guys will not be disappointed, hopefully. So I am bringing you guys some inexpensive makeup finds that I have been kind of accumulating probably over the last week, week and a half that I want to share with you guys. So let's go ahead and show these goodies. First thing I have been finding if you guys have not been watching my Dollar Tree hauls or you missed out on my Dollar Tree vlog. We have all been finding these Wet n Wild makeup brushes. They are cruelty free. They're vegan. So if you're into that and that's important to you, definitely support. But these were in Walgreens for 99 cents and I could not find them. These brushes have probably been out for about a month or two, if that. And I could never find them. They were sold at Walgreens. I could never find them. So when I saw them at Dollar Tree, I was shocked. So I'm gonna kind of going to go over each brush. And I'm so glad I found these because I really did need some new brushes. Because after kind of go, I went through my brushes and just kind of been getting rid of ones that are really old and nasty and all that good stuff. So this first one here is the contour brush. I love how it's angled because you turn it this way and it can just bam, just get it. So yeah, the, br the bristles are very soft. I'm be very curious to see how these wash up, if hairs come out, if it sheds a lot. Um, I will definitely up update you guys on that. But yeah, overall, you gotta love the color pink and white. It's something new for Wet n Wild because they're usually just black handles, black bristles. So, And I like that each brush has this little groove here. So when you hold it, you know, you got some place. I just thought that that was good. So very, very happy about this. Got two of the angle brushes. This is actually good for when you are cleaning up your brows. You know, you use conceal to clean up your brows. It's also good for when you are applying. Like if you guys sometimes, like today I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I usually always use an angle brush to kind of fill in my brows. So, and I needed some new, some new angle brushes. So I'm happy that I found these. This is what it looks like, you guys. Super cute. Love it. So this one here is the large concealer brush. So this would be perfect for when, or what I'm going to use it for is underneath my foundation. I do like to spot conceal with an orange color corrector and just hit my dark spot. So this is what I will probably use this for. But it's flat, so it'd be perfect for blending that out. And this, I believe, is the crease brush. You get right on in your eye crease there. So really, really excited for this because I do not have a lot of crease brushes. These are two of the large eyeshadow brushes. So they're kind of good, you know, just for eyeshadow. You know, I needed some more just plain old eyeshadow brushes. So I got two of these. And I'm not exactly sure because I took all the brushes out of the packaging. I'm not sure. I believe this is an eyeshadow brush. But this is actually good when you're going to do your eyebrow highlight. You can just pack it on. I believe this is the small eyeshadow brush. And this will be good like for the eyeshadow that goes right on your lid. It's good to just kind of pack it on. So I personally like these flat brushes for that reason. So you can really kind of pack it on. Okay guys, so I was watching, I've been watching Miss Clarence. If you guys follow her Instagram, make sure you guys do because she does a lot of swatches for things for makeup, which is pretty cool. So I, she was the, pers the first person that I saw to show these new, the new LA Color products that they have at the Family Dollar. So I went to my local one. They had a cute little display. Of course, a lot of it was gone because I was like out of the loop. So I was only able to get a couple things. I wish I would have found their highlighters, but they were out. The first thing I got is the LA Colors Dramatic Lash. And everything is a dollar, so it's super affordable. They have new packaging. These are the lashes 976 in Diva. So I absolutely love these. Love, 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 love. If you're in for the dramatics, yes. You guys know I'm all for the dramatics. So I love these. Next, I got a LA Colors Pout lip gloss and this is a matte lip gloss this is uh number 631 and let's kiss so it's kind of like a uh a nude color it does go on dry uh, it goes on wet i'm sorry but it dries matte so as you guys can see i'm rubbing it there and it's really not going anywhere as you guys can see i'm rubbing it so yeah i absolutely love this i have worn it already this color was way too much on my skin tone to just wear as a plain old lip gloss. So I did use a brown lip liner 
and it was perfect so i absolutely love this color the one thing i don't like is when you wear it and you do like this like it's like your lips stick so that i've never experienced that with yeah that was the kind of i was like what but other than that i do like it that was just my one kind of con to it is that it does that but it stayed on the color payoff is great as you guys can see and once you have that sucker on it's not going anywhere so yeah i found you guys is the la colors pout lip gloss in super shine so and this is number 643 in pucker up so it's kind of got that iridescent um uh, metallic-y type of color to it i guess when you see it in the packaging so this would probably be good cute over some type of lipstick i mean the color doesn't really show on my hand here so when you put it on your lips i'm assuming uh you kind of get more of the color the little bit of color that it has to it but i thought that this was cute maybe cute over some lipstick so the next thing i found is the la colors just plain old matte lipstick and and i hate that they colored up the color with the little uh Co they covered up the color with the family dollar tag but basically it's like a nude color so I'm going to go ahead and swatch this next to the other matte lip gloss so guys that's the color there that is awesome so I'm excited to give this a try love that how pretty is that love it so I'm glad I found these found these I'm really excited to try this one out because I haven't tried this one out yet next items you guys i was watching crispy if you guys don't follow her she's like a one of those um youtubers that has like over a million uh subscribers uh she does awesome makeup looks uh she's a makeup artist and i was watching one of her recent videos where she was talking about like her latest favorites or something like that and she said that she liked this nyc liquid liner she said that she liked she likes this one better than like felt tips she said with this one it gets like a really precise line so unlike a professional artist is talking about a little drugstore product and this is one of those items where youtube made me buy it but it was only two dollars and 82 cents at target so i'm like you know what just go ahead and pick it up and try it out so yeah i'm excited to try this out because I wing line is still something that I struggle with so we're gonna give this a go and see how this works out this is number triple eight in pearlized black next you guys if you guys have not been following me on Instagram I show swatches and I showed these on my snapchat as well when I first got them these are the wet and wild mega glow highlighters these are $2.99 at Walgreens and then I had a 50 cents off coupon so y'all know so but $2.99 is still very affordable this first one is called crown of my canopy so i have already worn this one already you guys i really really like this i'm gonna do a swatch for you guys on my hand here is the color right there it is absolutely pretty it's a it's just it's kind of like a peachy kind of gold color to me if that makes any type of sense next one is called precious petals and it has that same kind of flowery design on it and this is what i'm wearing on my cheeks today you guys if you guys you guys can see that highlights yes 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 so i, I th these are like fantastic for the price it's one of those inexpensive makeup products that's just like wow this is only three dollars so yes but wet and wild is coming through lately with their new products they are coming through they have the ombre blushes that i've been looking for that i want to try so yeah love it you guys have been watching my channel hopefully um but i did show these on my instagram my instagram and i think snapchat as well and if you guys watch my vlog you guys know nyx has a store here in minnesota in the mall of america and that store was like going there was like oh they had amazing items so i'm going to show you guys a couple things that i got also, when you go in there, you can give them your email address and you'll be basically one of the first people to know about any sales, discounts, and things like that. So I definitely signed up for that. But the first thing I got is the NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat Liquid Foundation. And lately, I have been super oily, like oil. So I've been looking for matte, matte. So and I didn't even know NYX had foundation. So i tried it on in the store and i absolutely loved it it does give 
pretty great coverage so it says all free it's water-based it's full coverage a matte finish and mineral enriched so I have the color number 14 in nutmeg so like I said I did try this in the store I did wear it all day because you guys know what sometimes when you go in the store that lighting is kind of off sometimes so I did look at myself in natural lighting and like I loved it like it just I felt like it really really matched me so yeah I do not have this on today but I did try it in the door in the in the in the door in the store I am going to do a separate video just on this NYX product so you guys can kind of see how it works is it full coverage is it not what you guys think about it so you can try it for yourself this now when she tried it on me she said it was $12.50 I'm like that that wasn't bad but then when that got to the register, it rung up for $7.50. So I think she might have been looking at something else because when, before I went out the door, I looked over there and it did say $7.50. So only $7.50 for a foundation that gives you full coverage. You cannot beat that. So I'm glad I found it and glad I went in there. You guys, this is the NYX Ombre Blush. Now if you guys know, Wet n Wild has a few Ombre blushes as well. So I'm going to go ahead and take it out. This is number 04 in Moave Me. So this is what the packaging looks like. And look at that, you guys. Is that not like gorge? I'm covering up the mirror. It does have a mirror on it. And I'm going to swatch it. Try to do the ombre swatch for you guys. That is it right here. Um, I used it the other day and I really really liked it I have to kind of play around with it a bit to see if I can get the you know the ombre on my face but it's very it's very light it is just it's a really really pretty. yeah guys so I'm super excited about this product this was ten dollars which I thought was a good deal I'm not gonna lie they had another really pretty color that was completely sold out they had all of all of the new lingerie. They just had the, everything in there. If you guys go watch my vlog on the NYX store, I will leave that in the description bar. Make sure you guys check that out because they have a lot of stuff that is not in the store. So last but not least, you guys, I don't know if I've ever showed you guys these. I was um watching one of my makeup room diva. Hey Shani, I was watching one of her haul videos and she was talking about these lashes i also saw these on platinum d's channel make sure you guys check out platinum d she's a professional makeup artist and she was showing these that she actually uses um i believe she uses these on her clients and herself i believe these are from ebay ebay lashes they are only 99 cents per pack and you get one two three four you get five lashes in the pack for 99 cents I picked up four packs and honestly I'm probably going to pick up some more this I'm gonna open it up so you guys can get kind of like a better look at it that is what they look like you guys as you guys can see um, I was able to get one where I was able to wear maybe three times and after that I had to toss them so I opened up a new pair so these are the eBay lashes that I have on today as you guys can see I really really like them they're not they're not too much I don't think but you guys know I live for the dramatics of eyelashes so that is what that looks like lashes I like these too because the band is thin so it makes it easier to put on sometimes when the band is super thick it makes it more difficult to put the lashes on but these were super easy to apply so thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this make sure you guys pick up these goodies they're all inexpensive items so yeah I'm looking forward to trying these products out so I'll uh, thank you guys so much for watching I'll check you guys out in the next video bye I want it, want it. I